people have started to think about what the impacts of companies are on the real economy, on the world, if you will. But investors mostly don't think about what their effects on the companies are. And that's where sustainable finance comes in. If you have a bank account where you have a little bit of money or maybe a lot of money, um, it doesn't just stay there in the safe. The bank will take the money and invest it somewhere. You probably don't know where, but they have lots of different options what they could do with the money. And, and usually banks take sort of a, you know, we do everything approach, um, but you own the money, so you should have some say in what happens with it. And that sort of activating that sort of link, that's what sustainable finance is all about. But what I think is important now that we move from the ambition and, and the wanting to do that to, to a framework where we actually see the effects of that. We don't want to lose the potential for, you know, you could say greenwashing, right? So you think you do something, but it, it doesn't really work. So we try to think through that and, and put data behind that mechanism in terms of environmental, social governance, performance indicators to, to measure what companies do, not just in terms of profits, but in terms of their environmental and social effects. Does it really change something or is it just replacing something else? So the ideal scenario would be many billions invested in ways that have positive contribution, according to our research.